Hey guys, my name is Kat. If you want to learn how to do this hairstyle, keep watching. Bravo! Bravo! <laughs> Hey friends! So friends, this is one of my longtime friends, Little Cutie. She is half Pakistan, half Jamaican. How cute of a mix is that? So friends, I'm just going to start off by doing a triangle part and I'm using the arch of her eyebrow as my guide for this part. And then I added some Blueberry Bliss Control Paste to her edges, but I only did it for this section. Just, I don't know, I ended up wanting to put some of that Shea Moisture mixture that I had made with the castor oil and I did end up putting some coconut oil in it and um, just because I thought you know since she might be having this in for a few days it's good that she has some you know oil to keep it moisturized and also I forgot to mention that I was spraying her hair with you know some aloe vera juice and water I just put half and half in a spray bottle so now for the next part I'm just making a line coming down towards her ear and then I'm just making sure it's moisturized with some of the aloe vera and water. And check this out. You guys see every kid who comes on the videos, they always want to check out their tongue. <laughs> so now I'm just going to make another triangle part. And this is actually my first time doing triangles all around the head. So the only way that I can really explain it, friends, is if you know how to draw a triangle, you'll know how to part a triangle. Um, I don't know how better else to explain it, but you will see in the, some parts of the video where I kind of like trace it with my comb and then make that part. And yeah, like I just visually just try to look at where that part is going to be and that, that's how I made these parts. So in the video, I'm just really focusing on the parting. Um, that's really what I'm going to just show you guys. I'm not really going to show you the, the putting in the elastics in and all that kind of stuff. So I hope it really helps you guys. And see here, sometimes I just had to use my comb just to show me where I'm going to put that part. And that is just a little bit of that Shea Moisture mixture that I'm using. So friends with little ones with this hair type, check out those popping curls. I mean, they're not popping as popping as they could be, but they're popping. <laughs> and check out this hair. See, I put a little bit of that Shea Moisture in there just to keep it moisturized while she, her hair is in braids. But you don't want to use this on a regular basis for hair because it's not a lightweight um, oil. From what I learned from you guys, almond oil, grapeseed oil, and jojoba oil are three really good lightweight oils for this hair. And that's what you probably want to be using in your spray bottle as well. And there are some other ones. You just have to do your research, check um, Google, and you can find out which other ones there are in case you want to use something else. So now this is one part that I had to trace so that I knew where to make that part. So I wish I had my camera positioned better, but I'm just showing you where I'm going to make the part. And then here I just made it. So now here is another part. And now I'm just making another part here. So friends, I hope this video is not too confusing. Like I thought that I should tell you guys when I'm making a part just because sometimes it got confusing for me when I was editing. I don't know, this video is kind of complicated. I'm like, I don't know if you guys can follow along, but that's what I'm hoping will happen. So. I thought it'd be best if I tell you when I'm making a part. So the parting back here was easy to see. I wish I slanted that part better just to make it more triangle-ish. And these other parts, friends, once it's parted, check it out. You will see, you know those like stars you make in school with just the lines? That's what I feel like this parting game looks like. And friends, hey, if you wanted to, you can like make smaller sections. She was just getting tired being in the chair, so I just made them pretty big here and then we're almost finished and here I'm just showing you guys what the parting game looks like and then friends if you wanted you could just leave it out like this and just have her curls all nice and pop in but what I did was I just went and braided it she wanted beads so I braided it and put some beads in it and oh my gosh she looks so adorable she absolutely loved it so my friends, I hope this video wasn't too hard to follow along and I hope you do this style. 
Also, my friends with little ones with hair type like Kiera's, can you please comment below and let her mom know what products you're using in your little one's hair? She would love your suggestions just because she's looking for some products. That would be so awesome. Thank you, friends. We love you. Bye.